So here we are. Here we are. Morrow River Cemetery. This is where it all comes together. The students have been on their quest. They've uh, researched their soldiers. And now, as you can see, they're looking for the individuals they came to honor today. They got up bright and early this morning. They were getting them centered. They got together last night, sat around, went over to why they're over here, what the purpose was for, and how important it is for them to be here to honor these gentlemen who gave their lives back that time 65 years ago. Why is that important as a teacher to get that message across to these kids? This is the actual ground. This is where they fought. And this is where they, their last moments on earth were, and this is where they're lying for eternity. And they have to know this. They have to know what their grandfathers did. They have to know what Canadians did. They had to know the sacrifice that they did at that point in time in order to try to ensure other people's freedoms that we take for granted today. And it has to be known that the freedoms that they have was paid for, and it was paid for in, by the blood of these men who are now buried here. They didn't have a chance to raise families, they didn't have a chance to see the children grow, they didn't have a chance to see their grandchildren, they didn't have a chance to uh, participate in Canada as we know it today because they're here. And we have to know that. We have to, we have to remember what they did. You think these kids will be affected emotionally by what they're seeing? Certainly. They, they will be emotional about it. Um, I can see it now by looking at some of the young, young students right now finding their soldiers. You re they research, they, they, they search on the internet, they put things together, and then when they get here and they finally find the resting place of the person that they're honoring, when they see him here, it, it all gels, it all comes together. And seeing all these, cro all these gravestones in an ordered row, like regiments in front of them, and they know that humanity is just below the ground where they're standing on, it, it, it affects them, and it'll affect them more as the day goes on today. How do you feel about today and the ceremonies that went on? I thought it was very touching. Some of the speeches that came on really, really pulled on your heartstrings. Why do you think it's important that Canadian students come today? Pay their respects, honestly. It's nice to see everyone from across Canada come together for a big memorial like that. Yeah. Got to meet new people, everybody came together, it was a lot of fun. We got to mingle with all the different schools from all over Canada, it was really cool. It, and it made us feel really, really proud yeah. of where we're from. Very yeah. proud. This, this whole thing has actually made me really understand yeah. what Canadian pride is. Yeah, like, just, definitely. To be able to, like, that we're from the same country, that yeah. these amazing men. Like, I didn't yeah. understand it all before. And that we can call ourselves Canadians as we were, like, I'm really, really proud. Yeah. Who are you representing? Um, Joseph Chapatis. Do you know anything about him or have any relation to him? I have no relation, but I knew he was in the RCA. He was in the anti-tank regiment. How old was he? He was 24 when he died. And why do you think it's important that we're here today? Well, or the Battle of Ortona isn't as remembered as it should be, and so I really want to bring it forth to remember the soldiers more.
that your attitude has changed toward the war from before the trip? Yeah, I've, I've, I've gotten a lot more respect for these soldiers now too and it it kind of it hit me in the heart because I just, when you read the tombstones too, you see like from father and from a mother and from a son, like you realize that these people were people, they're not just numbers. It wasn't 350,000 soldiers, it was men and women of Canada fighting and it really it hits you pretty deep.